one of the focal points of racing at the Val. Um, obviously with the Grand Heritage Race meeting taking place. Tony Soprano starts your day off. Yes, uh, Tony is a is a interesting horse. Uh, 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 he actually shows very nice work, but he's very nervous in the starting stalls. And, uh, you know, you always hold your breath when, when he goes in. Uh, he's, he's had a couple of starts now, and I think he's ready to start earning. So include him. And his stable companion in the same race, to keep him honest, is Global Heart. Global Heart had a very, very nice uh, uh, first run. Also got boxed, boxed in a bit and didn't get a clear run when, you know, uh, it was time to press the button. But uh, I would expect Global Heart to show quite a bit of improvement and wouldn't be surprised to see him in the, in the winner's box or at least in the trifecta. That's fantastic news as Shea Ballerina is your sole representative in race two. That's right, Andrew. Uh, Shea Ballerina still needs to, 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 to future and start dancing, but uh, I think she's maturing nicely. And for the um, more adventurous guys, add, add her in the quartets and things like that, I wouldn't expect to win yet, but she's definitely on the way up. Okay, profit and shareholder, um, different generations, but both very talented horses. Prophet obviously is not going to be in need of the run. He's a very fit horse, I would think, and this trip has to be right up his alley. I think so, Andrew, and you know, it's, it's, it's really nice to have a, a proper runner or two in, in, you know, the Grand Heritage. I'm excited to have a, a decent runner in it, and I, I honestly think Prophet will, will show, his, show his class here. He's, he's a huge runner, and uh, uh, I, I think we can win it. Uh, a horse like Shareholder came to form last time when he broke away and uh, broke loose and, and actually got a run and, and amply won. He's, he's, a, he's got some serious early form. And uh, if, if the day goes his way, he could just be there as well. So, so uh, it's, it's going to be a, a, a big quartet and, and trifecta pool. So, yes, for the, the adventurous guys, include them. And I think Profit uh, definitely... Uh, you know, almost close to a banker. Fantastic news. And then finally, uh, on the day, we might not get into a graphic discussion on the naming of Scott Adito, but it is an interesting one. Uh, Scott Adito has a lot of ability, Andrew. Uh, she's she's a, a master of my fate, and uh, uh, their temperaments are interesting. So on the day when she puts her head down, she's she's a very dangerous horse. So you can never leave her out. But she sometimes doesn't jump that well. And if she if she doesn't jump, she doesn't run well. But if she jumps in front and no, nothing challenges her early, she normally finishes off well. And I was very happy with the last run where she finished sixth. So expecting some improvement and definitely include her in the exotics. Thank <laughs> you.